Andreas Grankvist celebrates after converting his penalty Sweden opened their World Cup campaign with a 1-0 victory over South Korea in Group F thanks to Andreas Grankvist's penalty, which was awarded after the use of video technology. Janet Andersen's side were awarded a penalty in the 64th minute when VAR helped overrule referee Joel Aguilar's original decision for a challenge on Victor Klassen by Young Jun Lee inside the penalty area, from which Swedish captain Grankvist fired home 65. It proved to be the only goal of the game as Sweden won their opening game at a World Cup for the first time since 1958 to move level with Mexico at the top of Group F following their shock 1-0 win over Germany on Sunday. More to follow. Fantasy 6A side pick your dream team for England v Tunisia to win the guaranteed £1,000 jackpot. The biggest problem with NAR in its current form, aside from the inconsistent application, is that there is too much pressure to objectify the subjective. Today was an example of it working well, a clear and obvious error. But most games have had at least one bar controversy. Technology was supposed to make things blacker and whiter, not even grayer. The concept is fine but it isn't ready for a tournament of this significance. Wait until the games really matter, it'll be mayhem. More than anything else, it's getting really boring talking about it. If I wanted to talk about technology gone bad, I'd watch bloody Robocop 2 yet again. While chart latest Sweden's win means Germany probably have no margin for error in their last two games. If they draw against Sweden in their next match, their fate will be out of their hands going into the final match against Korea.